Welcome back to the channel, you guys. Here's some comedy silent, and yes, this is the second upload of the day. In today's video, we're gonna be checking out Gondola with the Whitley LMG. In the first video, we checked out Casablanca with the KG M40 AR, and now we got we gotta show some love to the other content. So we're gonna be playing some free for all with some recruit bots. Just take take a good look at the map and seeing how. The LMG does without any attachments and then with a class setup that seems kind of usable for my play style. Let's hop right into it. All right, here we are, are on Gondola and by default, the Whitley LMG has no recoil, has 80 rounds in the mag. But ain't gonna lie, without any attachments, they do be getting the job done. Wait, her shotgun. No, but yeah, no, no recoil on the Whitley LMG. Got an easy quad against these recruit bots, but it seems like bots don't really want to move on this map. But normally over here, that's where these sites, that's where one of the bomb sites would normally be located on this map. But look, no recoil, even though I just found the shots. Just look at that. It's just an easy two shot. And the reload is actually not that bad. That's actually a pretty decent LMG reload. I'm not gonna lie. Normally, you would be away from the action for a few, few seconds, but no. It's pretty. Wow, I got wobbinged by a recruit bot. Okay. Props to you, bro. But now, let's switch over to the Whitley gun with the attachments that I would normally run. But uh, first of all, let's let's use the ball turn gunner one more time just for you guys. So, this also will give you guys a chance to see the overall um overall map from from a sky view. Which honestly, this map from what I've checked in custom games for S and D, S and D might not play as um as we expect. I'm gonna be running this as my new streak, personally. It just gets the job done. Okay. I'm most likely gonna die, but. No, I'm so alive. Hey, don't shoot me down, bro. I know you're a bot, but. Don't shoot me down. Gotta respect your elders, bruh. Alright, let's call in the dogs, because why not? But the ideal class setup that we're gonna be running um, has, I think it's the 150 damage. Damage mag. Which honestly, this just makes the gun even better. Like, I'm not even gonna lie with you guys, it just makes the gun just way better. You don't have to reload as much. And. The reload is still relatively quick, no recoil as well. So, um, oh, if you guys are wondering what the attachments are, um, these would be the attachments that we're rocking with this new LMG. This is gonna be the more ideal class setup you guys might wanna use once the gun gets added into the game. But overall, I, I kinda like it. I'm, I'm always a fan of slow fire rate LMGs that have relatively low recoil. Wow, I, I can't hit that. But yeah, I, I'm always gonna go for an LMG that shoots kind of slow, but packs a punch. But I won't. I'm gonna get right now. I will not be surprised if, if this gun gets nerfed within like a month or two after it drops. Like I, I seriously won't be surprised if it, if that does happen. Somebody's in here, bro. So we got the we got the up top part. Hopefully we don't die. Well, there's a shotgun kid up there. So there's always this bottom part. This is where one of the bomb sites would be for S and D. Which you guys might be wondering, why are you talking about S and D? Well, 
Normally over here we we like to show some SMD content over here. But yeah, that bottom is one of the bomb sites, and I personally do not like that bomb site. Damn, you're you're so bad. But, but not bad. I think I think this damage mag with this barrel, I think it makes it like a two shot. Like a two shot upper body. Let's get in the gondola, baby. Actually, no. We actually need the other one. No? Not yet? No. Get me on. Get me on. Let's go, baby. Th this is so cool. Th I don't know what this map reminds me of. It reminds me of a map that we've, ar we've already seen. But I just can't put my finger on it. Like, I seriously just can't put my finger on it. And... Oh, it's about time we have to reload him. <laughs> Alright. But they're... It's really not that... Honestly, this map... It might not be my favorite, favorite map. But, I'm not gonna lie. I... I do see myself playing this map from time to time in SMB. Not really in... Not really in respawn. But, I do see respawn being... Beneficial for camo challenges, I will say. Alright. Come out. I don't even want to come out, bro. Just come out. No? Alright. You don't want to show me some love? Alright, I see you. Damn. These kids don't want to... Don't want to be? Alright. I see you. No, but... Personally, the new content that we're going to be getting in Season 2... I... I like it so far. We just have to wait and find out how the content's gonna play in pubs once everybody else gets their hands on it. Because the map may be good, but at the end of the day, it all depends if players actually... It all depends if people actually play the map how it's intended. But hey, the, two, the new AR, the new LMG, no recoil, good damage, good mobility, everything. They seem pretty good. Are they gonna get nerfed? Most likely. Especially since it got low recoil and high damage. Yeah. I would expect either a damage nerf within like a month or two after they drop, or maybe just a recoil increase. But overall, the maps are good, the weapons are good. Uh the new streak is it might be a little bit overpowered because especially in SD. You can actually call in the streak right off the rip, right at the start of the round. So that means that you'll be able to just wipe out a team in just in like, what, 15, 20 seconds at the start of a round. So yeah, it might be a little bit broken, but overall, we're getting new content, which is always a plus. But if you guys did enjoy it, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe. I will bring you guys some gon gondola and... Casablanca with the new weapons once season 2 actually drops on February 14th it's gonna drop around at 9 a.m. if I'm correct but if you guys didn't enjoy don't forget dropping a like and comments help me out so much so I, re I would really appreciate it but thank you guys so much and I'll catch you guys in a future video peace out and have a great rest of the day